Oh. How does one open this? Oh, here we go. Lovely. Good morning from Rome. He's still in bed. It's a common theme here. I got in at about 3 a.m. last night, didn't I? It was pretty late. Uh, came in from Portugal. But this week we're here in Rome for the Ryder Cup with BMW. Um, I've actually got to go out and do some filming this morning. Are you going to explore Rome? Yeah. What? This is my first time in Oh my God, you're going to have the best time with the best food ever. You also look like a slug. This is probably a great angle for me as well. <laughs> I'm ready to go. Quick turn around. Hi. Ollie's actually out of bed. It's only like 7 a.m. guys, so. It is not. Look at that white hair. Look at your new glasses. Yeah, slightly different, just flat at the top. You lost your last ones, didn't you? Yeah, and I've got a ginger shot. Ginger and apple. That's nice. I bet that's from Pratt. Is that from Pratt? Yeah, I knew it. Do you want some? Have a bit more, it's good for you. That's not intense enough for me. Have some more, it's good I for like you. it when it burns. You're weird. I love ginger so much. Delicious. Some of them like literally do burn. That's quite a nice one. All right, we need to go. I'm always rushing and running. Yeah, who's what's that? My pet peeve is having a crumpled shirt and there's no iron. Me too, it's so frustrating. No, I iron all your clothes. <laughs> this is just not good enough, is it really? You look good. We're staying at the Western Excelsior in Rome. This is the grand staircase. I feel like everything's really regal here. Look how fancy it looks. It's got all these like chandeliers. Champagnes. <laughs> <laughs> we have to walk to the addition hotel, you can't even see that. This is Rome. I feel like a proper tourist. You're going to go for a little explore today whilst I go to work. Yeah. And then tomorrow you're at work with me every day. Yeah. 5am five, 5 wake up, security guard. <laughs> security guard, yeah, you can call yourself a security guard. They call breakfast box cafes over here. I mean, they're Italian. I know. Probably like fine. cafe. That's Probably sounds deep. better than we say it, just because yeah. it's Italian vibes. Quite weird, being in a place that you've never been in before. I've literally just rocked up. Yeah, you have. <laughs> I haven't done any research or anything, which is quite weird for me. I can't believe you've never been to Italy. You've no. missed out on Italian yeah. food for your whole life. This is your thing. Oh, perfect. Thank you so much. That's nice. We get a bottle of water as well. You came all the way from Munich? Yes. Whoa. <laughs> like 12 hours. Was Drove in the car? Yes. Oh, wow. Yeah. So, yeah, we have a pretty huge fleet here in, in uh, Rome at the moment. That's we crazy. Here we are, Marco Simone. We have the biggest sign here ever. Ryder Cup. Just noticed that that is Team Europe, obviously. That must be Team USA with the red doors. Wow. There's yeah. a back entrance. I'll just follow the music. Like I generally had no idea what to expect, but this place is ridiculous. Like I'm not even kidding you. It's ginormous. There's so many people here and it's only a practice day. Like, that whole building is the shop. Like you think the open shop's big, don't you? But that is like gigantic. Gigantic. They spend a lot of money in there. This is crazy. I'm so excited. Look, look over there. That's the range over there. It just keeps getting bigger, this place. This is your home for the week, isn't it? Here we go. This is where people work behind the scenes, guys. It's not all glamorous. I literally keep filming this because I just feel like every time I see it, I'm still as amazed as the last time I saw it. Welcome to the vlog. Thanks, thanks for having, thanks for having <laughs> me on. It's a real treat so far. This is crazy. I keep saying, how many times have I said it to you already? Uh, what was it? It's crazy. Okay, it's crazy. Oh, well, it's crazy, as in this. This is cr it's crazy. You've been in the shop as well, which looks ginormous. It's like a warehouse. You want to see the quickest way to drop 500 euros in your life? <laughs> is that how much you just spent? There it is, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, um, is it yeah. for all your um, little worker bees? Uh, I've got some stuff for me and then the like cat for David. Oh. It's his birthday in a few days. Happy birthday in a few days. Thank you very much. <laughs> and then I got some stuff for giveaways as well, so. I'm about to test my first Italian coffee of the trip. It's actually extremely dark. It looks like soy sauce. Mmm. Wow. Oh my god, that's so strong. I think I just licked a coffee bean. Strong. It's not like what you get in England. <laughs> oh wow, that is dark. Have you tested this coffee? It is so strong. Look how dark that is. It's like so strong. Yeah, that's like an American. Like Try it. This on. Yeah, we're doing a coffee cap. Quadruple espresso. Intense. What do you think? Oh, that is a face of... He loves it. That's so good. Uh, it's like you literally are licking a coffee bean. <laughs> okay, that's his. <laughs> I didn't really, I wasn't really looking what I was getting. 
And it's kind of like a... Have you tried it on your head? A yeah. Brilliant cap? Yeah, but it's... You look good! It's fine, isn't it? But it's just a bit like... Um, higher. You know what? When yeah. these caps go high around the ear... Is that all it is? Does, does, does it still look passable? Yeah, you look good. Well, yeah, obviously, but does the, <laughs> does the hat look okay? Yeah, tighten it up a little bit. Well, that's the thing, like the actual back bit. Oh. Like, that makes no difference to the tightness of the... Because men have generally bigger hair. Sure. Yeah, just it looks, quite likes itself. It just looks like a, a hat. It is. Well, why do we put labels on these things? Are you ready for the big reveal? The latest Ryder Cup fan, here he is. I am. Um, Ryder Cup right now. Okay, <laughs> what kind of Ryder Cup I have? Could it be any more Ryder Cup? I don't think so. Wow. Okay, let's Thank go. Ready for the runway. Just want to put this coffee in the night. I don't know if you can see it. It is crazy. I don't know why I'm like going wild over this, but test it. Crazy. Strong. <laughs> That's super strong. Is it colour? Oh my god. Isn't it? You want to try some Alex? No. Rita, no. No, you. you try it. No, <laughs> what did you put in there? I want, kind to, sleep. Of secret... I want to sleep tonight. I want more. Yeah. <laughs> you kind of secretly like it, but it does give you a I love massive that. hit. That's the stuff that makes you go to Burkheim. <laughs> it's intense. Right, I'm just going to go off, do a little job, and then I will be back to show you more of the event. Look who's decided to join me on my day at work. Hey, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Got bored on room on your own, didn't you? Yeah, it's not a lot to do. Well, there is, but I just couldn't find it. This place is so cool, isn't it? Yeah, it's mega. Look at this, Ryder Cup Village. I can't believe how big it is. It's huge, isn't it? And like, when you drive in from the motorway, you can see down onto it. It just looks... Unreal. Yeah, outrageous. They've done such a good job. What did you do this morning? Had a... I can't remember what it was called now. Basically a ham and cheese sandwich, but in Italian it sounds a lot cooler. I had the world's strongest coffee and I thought I was going to die and I've given it to everybody. Oh my god, the, <laughs> the coffee that I had was so good. Was it strong? No, I had an oat milk cappuccino, but it was so smooth. Oh, that's nice. I yeah. think I needed some milk or something because mine was so strong. Yours looked like dark chocolate. <laughs> it was. And then I got bored, got a bit of FOMO because you said how good it was and I thought... Get and I sent videos. Yeah. It's just Broke. massive. Yeah. I don't even know where to start. These are just all golf balls. I think they're recycled golf balls, these are. All well, these really cute little food trucks here. That's where I got my coffee from this morning. There's a big food tent over there, which we're going to go to. Now you can see the shopping centre. It's huge. It's like Selfridges. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited. First tea tomorrow is going to be sick. Yeah, we're going to have to wake up early though, so I hope That's you're ready right. for that. You're That's not used fine. to it. That's no, fine. For special things, I'll get up early. Yeah, like golf. <laughs> like golf. Just golf. Uh, that looks great. What did I order? Slow roasted pork bun. This is so cute, isn't it? Yeah. It's so nice. And then, peach sauce tea. I love a peach iced tea. Do you like peach iced tea? I do. Well, you copied me. <laughs> you weren't going for that originally. Every time I have something, it's like, I want that too. Delicious. I've never had it in a can before. It tastes better out of a can. Do you think? Yeah. Look at that. There's a lot of meat there. I actually thought she didn't put a bun in here, and I was like, oh. When I said I didn't want a meal, I didn't realise it meant I didn't get the bun either. You didn't get chips. I didn't get chips, yeah. I do love chips, but like, I don't know. I have a strange relationship with chips. I do really like them. And I just said no to pesto. I just thought pesto was a bit weird in here. I think it would have been nice, but let's see. Let's okay. have a taste test. Big mouthful of that. <laughs> kind of dry. Yeah, that's why I think you need the sauce. <laughs> I'm not a big sauce fan either. I like ketchup and gravy. Gravy would have been nice. Mmm. Can I try What you, you said it's a bit dry. What are you rating? It is dry. What are you rating it? Not a 10 keys, I can tell you that. Dry. Yeah, it could do with the pesto sauce. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe like a four, what oh, do you reckon? That's not very good. Don't get the pork belly, guys. Yeah, it's just a bit dry is all. Just need the moistening up and it'll take it right to an eight. Excuse me, sir. Can I offer you a drink? No, thank you, sir. Here, wait. <laughs> He's um, a very important person here at BMW. Not really important, but... Um, <laughs> He's drinking my drink. Why are you drinking my drink? Marcus gave it to me. Why did he give it to you? <laughs> In the one of your lines, you always say like, "Come with me, I show you around." Yeah, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> and just like that, that's yeah. how I walk. Hello, hello, everybody. Hello from Zerman, Germany. Yeah, just practicing her lines and doing some filming. Sliding helps her remember it quicker. I just said that. <laughs> Did you? Yeah. I can't help it; it's just how it gets into my brain. I have like one minute to learn, then I gotta go. She loves pacing up and down, learning her lines. 
the atmosphere will be electric. Or should I say all electric? Kind of fitting for the Ryder Cup, isn't it? They're my lines. <laughs> 10 out of 10, right? Every single one of these cars is basically taking golfers and VIPs to the course here at Marco Simone, which is actually pretty cool. Like I've never seen so many BMWs and you saw from the car, the taxi I was in earlier today, he drove all the way from Munich, 12 hours to be here. So so many of these people have driven like 12 hours just to be here to drive everyone at the Ryder Cup. It's wild, isn't it? Uh, Ollie came in an i7, loved it, didn't you? So nice. I want to get one back home. Is there an i7 here? It's the one with the big screen in the back. So this is an i7. This is what you drove in, isn't it? Yeah. Where's the TV? Yeah. It's out there. Oh, the it's TV here. comes down. TV? Yeah. Oh. Here we go. Oh, wow. wow. Cinema Whoa. mode. Look at that. Whoa, that's massive. Oh my God. That is so cool. I'm having a little sleep <gasps> as well. We've got Netflix and YouTube. Yeah. Oh, you've got a Ryder Cup app. Is it touchscreen? Oh wow, it is. Oh cool. <laughs> this is wild. This is where you have a chauffeur. This car's built for people to be driven around. Yeah, we need to get one of these. What? And you can drive me around. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, 29 degrees. Yeah, it feels every bit of it. Wow. I don't think we can stream the Ryder Cup today because it's uh, not started yet. I think it's the only Thursday to Sunday. But if you have an i7, you basically can stream the Ryder Cup, which is really cool. Yeah, they're like electric seats. You've got like padding on your seat. I can't remember how you do it. Wait, let's have a look. Uh, seats, here we go. You really drove here in luxury today, didn't you? That bit. Is it massaging you? Let's move. Djokovic over there taking some pics with people. Probably running away from people like me. You want a picture with him? You're back on the vlog again. I was just live. You know, not very good on camera, very shy. Oh yeah. Great to be here, <laughs> sun shining. Working this week. Working really hard this really week. Really hard, um, but got the weekend off convenient. Yeah, yeah, lots of pizza, lots of pasta, putting on a few kegs, we love it. Every time I meet someone, you're like, how do you know each other? I know, I always get confused. I'm like, what, do you but know each Aussie. other? He's an Aussie and I think at the moment every Aussie hates me, so he's going to know me after the accident. Yes, yeah, so I didn't know that George knew, all, well, he doesn't know you, because you were talking like you knew each other. I was like, oh, have you met before? Oh, he knows cricket, obviously, doesn't he, so... Yeah, he just didn't know anyone knew cricket. Everyone knows cricket. Well, clearly, I didn't. Best viewing numbers of, the, of ever this summer. Really? Well, you better get playing better then, hadn't you? Oh, yeah, that's a <laughs> you get cut. <laughs> wow, I can't get over how... I keep saying it, busy it is. <laughs> but we're in the shop queue now and it literally is so long. Just messaging Rick. He's like, every golf event is like a brand new experience for you because I was saying how crazy and mind blowing I am and how cool it is here. There's so many people, I've never seen this many people in my life. And we're going in the queue for the shop and we are going to buy, well, Ollie's going to help you buy some goodies for you guys so we can do a giveaway. Look, he's like, yeah, this is exciting. I don't know what you guys would want. But you know what people would yeah, Ollie, what are you doing? Good. We've got some good, great fans out here. Welcome to the mega shop. This is so big, isn't it? I guess in America this would be like um, Target. I don't even know where you start. We have to start with Europe though, surely. Ryder Cup gilet. You love a gilet, do you? I love it. Uh oh, this is where it starts. You're a slippery slope. Me? Goes find one thing and then he wants the whole shop. That's in quite Rome. nice, isn't it? I guess that's good for home. Yeah, and it's just like subtle. Why have the gilets not been raided? You actually look quite brown. I've been in the sun. <laughs> I think that's the one. How much is it? I don't know. It's where I'm slimming down. I'm a large man. Whoa. Guess how much that is? 115 euros. You know what I'm going to do? What? I'm going to pick up loads of things that I like. And then when it comes down to it at the checkout. Make me pay. No. Like, <laughs> pick the favorites favorites yeah i like doing that whoa that is actually a crazy cool jacket Ryder cup 2023 price tag 1437 that's wild thinking a wild <laughs> look at him already <laughs> look at that look at perfume Ryder cup perfume well, what about like alignment stick case? That's yeah. quite cool. Head covers. I think you should get like one of all. This is all the stuff I've got, but I realise I've got only stuff for you guys, nothing for myself. But how cool is this grip? That's going in your little goodie bag. Got cool markers, balls, towels, cap. This is all just for himself. <laughs> and other people. And other people. Getting a bit out of hand. I'm about to splash a lot of cash for you guys. Basically, I'm debating. I've got this for the women. I think this for the guys. 
That's cool, yeah. We'll take the ball, the markers, the bricks. We should have got a bag, really. The flag. Should have got a bag. We made a rookie mistake. This is the Europe one, that was America. We need to get rid of the American one immediately. <laughs> this is how much money I am splashing on you guys right now. 409 euros. This is the giveaway right here. I need the receipt, look how long it is. <laughs> The opening ceremony. Well, that's quite good. Little charging stations. You can watch it over there too. <gasps> I seven. We got an I seven. That is so cool. Oh my! The door opened for me. <laughs> that's so cool. Thank you. You're welcome. We just back at the hotel. Locked out of our room, so Holly's gone to go and sort that. This is all of the stuff that we bought. And I also need to run to the Adidas Roam store now to do a quick video there. We are just off to the Adidas shop to pick up some new golf shoes, are we? They're the MG. No, where's MG come from? MC. MC 87 4D. 4D printed soles. Pretty cool. Apparently there's a little, there might be a photo of me in there. It's like boop. And then we're gonna go get some dinner somewhere. Yep. Starving. Went in room. This is cute, little room. Now you like room, don't you? He oh, likes Rome now, you. after he's saying, oh, I don't really know Rome. It's a bit weird being in a place I don't know. Now look at him, loves it. Beautiful, oh, so pretty. Let's go. Thing is, we're on a short time schedule. It shuts in like and barely any minutes. a thousand so. photos. Prettier at night, I reckon. It's so pretty. Did you come here yesterday? No, no. Oh. I went the other way. So cute. Wow, look at it. All these pretty buildings. I feel very Italian right now. Do you? <laughs> Ciao bella! Mi piace questo posto? What are you saying? I like this place. In Italian. There's music as well. It's taking us 40 minutes over here. Welcome to Adidas a la Room. So basically Adidas have done like a little pop-up section here just because of the rider car. But all of the best stuff here, this is the best dress ever made by nature. It's so soft. Look how soft it is. 10 out of 10, would highly recommend. They've got it in black as well, all time it black. Men's stuff. Actually, all of this is gold. It's a win. Okay, this is what we're here for. We're here for the MC87 4D printed. Check this out. How cool is that? What do you think? Do you nice. like them? Yeah, they're nice. We've just been in the Adidas store. Ollie just said what just happened was not normal. Can we turn this round? We need both of us in this. <laughs> Why do I look so small? <laughs> I have to hold it left handed because of this. You might have been that side. How about I hold it? Wow. Weirdest experience ever. What happened? I don't know. <laughs> I literally went into the store to pretend to buy some shoes to then not buy the shoes. Because I'd get in them anyway. Yeah. Otherwise I'd doubly have them. The woman in the store is like, what is going on? <laughs> Got <laughs> a nice little golf ball out of it though. Yeah, which is pretty cool. Every purchase out here in Rome. In honour of the Ryder Cup, you do get a little Adidas golf ball Roma. This is my fee for doing the filming. What? I thought that was mine. No, it's mine. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, just day in the life really. Just, just do what I'm told. Stuff again. But we're going to go find dinner now. Actually, I need to get some AirPods because... Uh, Mia left her AirPods on the plane. I did. And I left my retainer in Portugal. For someone that's so good at everything else, you are forgetful. No, do you know what it is? Because I'm constantly rushing from place to place. I'm, how long did I have? Like 10 minutes to get from shoot to the taxi, shower, pack my bags. Well, I've had most of that, but like... But you didn't lose them. No, because I forgot them because I was like rushing. I thought they were on the plane. And then the plane, yeah. Then I had to rush off the plane because I had a connection and I was transferring to my other flight, which was delay because the other one got delayed. <laughs> you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Well, I must say this is a very fancy Apple store. How grand is this? This is going up to the Genius Bar because apparently you can buy an airport case just on its own. It's got the pillars that you like. I love, I really want a house with pillars. That's my dream. I'll die if I ever get a house with pillars. Look at this pretty little restaurant. It's so sparkly. Isn't it cute? Beautiful. <laughs> it has zero care. I think it's really cute. So come to this really nice restaurant that was recommended by the Apple guy called San Marco. There is honestly a gazillion pieces on it. Oh, we also have Mr. Finch joining us and David. Where your second course after the menu. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's, they say best to last. <laughs> We've got some cacio pepe, said in the pure Italian accent. Wow, it's like you're a local now. 
That was amazing. Home and mission. Yes. Yes, please. One there, one there. This is like crispy thin as well. Like, look at that. Here are so whoever is brave enough to pick up that Grim spoon, you can have a two. Strawberries and ice cream. <laughs> and a tiramisu for two. It's <laughs> a very <laughs> Italian taste test. Delicious. That's really good. Oh, I got an eye roll. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's like eye roll from bit to bit. That's good. That's, I mean, that's pretty difficult to like tackle. There's a lot yeah. of stuff going on. It looks unreal, doesn't it? Oh, oh. Not as good reviews. Try that, it's weird. It's not like a usual creme brulee. It's a bit, they're not got the texture. Yeah, that's what it is, the texture. This ice cream's really good. I've basically shown this new app called Bean. And it says how many countries you've been to across the world. So I've done 33 countries, 16%. What do you want, Pete? I don't know. I, I feel there's so many countries here. And I've just not been to enough of them. 23? 23. It's only 11% of the world though. It's a bit disappointed, isn't he? <laughs> I'm actually really good, yeah. He started on a high and he didn't want to low. The final touches. Hey, welcome to day one of the Friday Cup. And it is very early. I don't know why I just did that voice. <laughs> yeah, it's weird. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's go. Not rushing, ever. Have you got everything you need? Probably not, but it's fine. Here's the outfit, guys, for day oh, one. I was like, where's the camera? <laughs> you excited? Yes. Yeah. We're very excited. Hey. Considering it's six o'clock in the morning. This is the this first is time you've entered a vlog. Not this, asleep. This is about as excited as I get for 6am. <laughs> it is bright and early. The sun is shining. <laughs> Beautiful morning. I don't think I start work till like 10 today. Easy. <laughs> Middle of the tree. Editing the video we took yesterday in the Adidas store. So you'll be seeing that on my story very soon. Except you only get 60 seconds on Insta stories. So I literally have to edit it all out. And I'll try and get it down to under a minute. Some great filming as well, isn't it? Uh, oh my god. <laughs> 10 out of 10, top tier. Top tier filming. I'm on 101 now, so I need to just get down an extra second, which is perfect use of the car time. It's going on 11 minutes left, and it took 30 minutes to get to the course today. Beautiful place. We are entering the Ryder Cup pathway. <laughs> the Ryder Cup 2023. It's actually so exciting, like. I had zero expectations and then yesterday when I got to the course and I saw how cool it was I was so excited for today, tomorrow, the next I even went home and I was like oh my god I'm so glad that you're like here to share this experience with me because it's just so cool Alright, we've got to go through this little security pit now You can actually hear people already going crazy yeah, you can do it. Cheering Look at that as well Oh yeah, just walk in front of me. Yeah, I'm a good side. <laughs> side. Oh, sorry. That's what you always do to me. To be fair, Ollie and I both had the same good side, which is a bit of an issue. What hole is this? It's the 18th. Look at that water. It's to you, Ollie Robinson. Terrible lead though, mate. Terrible. Look how many people there are. This is crazy. This is for the first tee. It's 6.58 a.m. In the UK, that's 5.58, that's 6 a.m. and all these crazy people getting up this early. Can't get over it. Like, it's wild. Look, that is actually like a Coliseum. There's... How big is a stadium when you play? Cricket? Uh, it depends where we play. 30,000? What is the most number of people who have seen you play? 120k. 120k. How many do you think is over there? Like if it was filled. Feels like a football match but in the morning. Can you hear people already? Oh wow. Look at that. Wow. It's like a football stadium. This is mental. Oh my god, I've never seen this many people at like 7am before. What are they all doing? This is crazy. This is like the whole of Europe. <laughs> Sorry, oh, 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 you get sick of us <laughs> Oh now. my god, hello. How yeah. are we doing? Isn't this cool? It's very cool, yeah, yeah. Like, but like, this might be like the the best first tea experience I've ever had in my life. Like you're seeing right now, great viewing spot. Mm, very good, very excited. You very sound ex it. <laughs> so, after this coffee, I'll be able to like properly express my emotions. Be the Pete on YouTube people know. Yeah, I, I, I only. <laughs> I only come alive after a few coffees. So this is the BMW lounge. 
It's actually really nice, isn't it? Very nice. I don't know what I was expecting. Oh, look at that. Proper Europe versus USA. Where are you going? Coffee machine. Ooh, that's cool. chocolate sauce in the morning. Are you counting your calories? Yeah, you're not allowed this, but if you weren't, I'm sure you would tuck in on the chocolate. sly. Stop filming me then, I can't eat it. <laughs> Protein. Lovely. Trying. Trying. It must be hard to say no to all of this. Yeah. Scrambled eggs are really yummy. Doesn't, I mean, aesthetically, I'd say it's a one out of ten. But, but taste? Tastes really good. Seven and a half. Whoa. Wow, it's got even busier. Isn't it just so stunning though? Like, it's just beautiful. The views are stunning. On a scale of one to 10, how excited are you? Mm. Look at that little face. It's like an 8.5. And if you, if it was like, say, 2 p.m. in the afternoon. And then it'd be like a 10, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. And cool how they've made this, what, marquee? No, it's not even a marquee, is it? A building. It's a building. <laughs> you can see so many holes from up here. That's the first tee. First, and then that must be the seventh. Yeah, the seventh green. Yeah, 70 is there. 18th is over there. <laughs> Where? Oh yeah, you can actually see. Oh, what's going on? events are usually very different to this. I don't know, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. You think I'm crazy? <laughs> it's really cool. That is cool, it's very cool. Like when you know golf is something completely different when you come to yeah. this. I think that's what it is. I've been to many golf events and I've never ever ever seen crowds like this. I've never seen people chanting so much, like really getting into it. Everyone is fully invested. Whether it's on the rough, on the fairway, people are like, woo! And everyone is rooting for a team. Like when you play any other sport, people are rooting for a team, aren't they? You don't really do that in golf. Like no, there's individual. so many individuals yeah. that no one roots for one. They root for many and it's kind of like a bit, oh, this person, this person. Here, you're either Europe or USA. That's it. That's amazing. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. You get a team. Everyone wants to support a team, don't they? Yeah, so what is the rules for this one? So it's uh, alternate shots. Come on, Tyrrell. Love a bit of Tyrrell. I was going to say love a bit of Tyrrell. I didn't really mean it like that. But. <laughs> I mean, Tyrrell's really nice. We love Tyrrell. Love to know Tyrrell. <laughs> <laughs> didn't mean it like that. I meant like, we love you, Tyrrell. <laughs> He's a really nice guy. He Keep puts on this facade, but he is actually so funny. Keep digging. <laughs> No, he's just nice. No, so I'm just so proud. She's still going with the Tyrrell <laughs> stuff, guys. <laughs> he just hit a great shot onto the green. Oh my God. 
So a little bit left, is it? Oh no, it's too short. Oh. <laughs> the crowd love it. The crowd love it. The thing is, is in America last year at the last Ryder Cup, it was just Americans going wild. Here, it's Europeans going wild. I love how they've got the screens there, which yeah. is like literally showing what you would see, like up close, personal. Then they come out onto the first tee box, and then you're getting the real life experience here. But then you can see the shots and the shot traces going on there. It's just like they've done it so well, haven't they? So yeah. well. And also for, you know, everyone said to me, as someone who's coming to watch, it's so difficult to see because you're like layers and layers and rows behind people. But the first tee box, it's literally slanted. So whether you're at the back or the front, you can actually see, which is so nice. But yeah, that's actually really nice. Like, so if I was going to design a golf course for the Ryder Cup, I'd make it slanted like this. Actually, not just for the Ryder Cup, just golf course in general for a few viewers. It'll be like a stadium throughout. Representing the United States of America, Ricky Fowler. You love Ricky, don't you? You He's love cool. Ricky. He's a cool guy, isn't he? Seth is such a nice guy, isn't he? Seth and Dwayne, my They're favourite. They're so, like, just kind, lovely people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mr. Bunker. Ooh. Ooh. A few nerves, I reckon. Oh, yeah. First. That is definitely a lot of first-team nerves. I'd be nervous. I mean, playing the BMW with a fraction of this amount of people, that would get me nervous, but also it riles well. them up, doesn't it? It's like gets you so excited yeah. and ready, and and it's his first Ryder Cup. Oh yeah, and it's first. And he must be absolutely gassed, like nervous out of his brains, but he, so excited. He'll have that feeling where you can't feel your body. Yeah. You know, Did you ask numb. him how he was feeling about the Ryder Cup? He was fine when we played with him. It's but different when you get here, isn't two it? Two weeks away. Here we go. We've got Dad on the Ryder Cup camp, first time. How was your first Ryder Cup, Dad? <laughs> there we go. It's his first ever Ryder Cup. <laughs> oh yeah, I love to. Here it is, replay. I nearly got a hole in one. What the hell? <gasps> that is crazy. That was nearly a hole in one. That was so sick. From here it looks so cool. So cool. It looks literally like, it looks like on the whole. Yeah. I got you a little treat though. What have you got me? Thank you. A little European flag? Yeah. This is cute. There. You, you watch. By 1pm, everyone will have these on their sleeve. <laughs> <laughs> Trendsetter. So you get gimmies in the Ryder Cup? Well, it's up to their discretion. Yeah. Well, we've just come to... What is this, the fan zone? I don't know, where we were yesterday, the village. This is our current setup, up to the goal. How's your morning going? We got a bit cold, didn't we? Yeah, I had to come sit in the sun for a bit. <laughs> Felt really cold up there, mm. but it's so nice here. I almost get the sun, but you're blocking it. Oh, wow, so sunny. Try and get some tan before I head back to the UK. <laughs> yeah. God, Hong Kong is going to be hot. Hong Kong's hot? Yeah, Hong Kong's always hot. It's is like it? hot and humid. I'm really gutted I'm not coming. Maybe one day we can go to Asia. I think I felt like I wasn't sure what travelling with you was going to be like. Really? What did you think it was going to be like? I didn't know if you were going to be like non-existent all day. It depends, like for this event. This event, yeah. It's not been too bad because I have a very like... It's quite like a strict schedule, mm. so I know when I'm free and I know when I'm not. Whereas other ones, I don't have a, such a strict schedule, so I never know what I'm actually doing until they're like, Mia, come here, Mia, come here, and then yeah. some days it's absolutely chaotic. I think also, like, depends where you go. Some places I really want to go, so even if you were busy, it wouldn't matter as much. Like here, I got bored an hour, didn't I, yesterday? Yeah. And I was like, can I come to the golf course? <laughs> Hong Kong, I mean, I'd like to go, but I don't, the same thing, I don't really know where to go or the attractions yeah see hong kong is a cool place to be yeah also i just did not know you've got gimmies in the Ryder cup and they play mind games with the gimmies so they will say give them a long long putt as a gimme and then when they have to do a short putt because they've not practiced any long putts 
they'll be like, no need to put it out, and they'll be like, what? Or they'll just walk off. On the seventh, the USA team walked off, didn't they? And Victor was like looking at them for ages. Seeing like, are you going to make me put this or gonna, what? Yeah, you're going to give it to me. And they just walked off, didn't say anything. So then he had to knock in like a two inch putt yeah. and pick out the ball. Me. We're winning. Two up, two up, two up. One up at the moment. But I think it's more fun when, like if it's neck and neck. But then they've got 18 holes, so they've got quite a lot of holes to go. I like the mind games. That's where, that's one thing. I don't know why I'm bringing it back to cricket. But um, one thing I didn't realise, how much strategy goes into cricket? Loads. Yeah, loads, loads of mind games. More. So there's a tactic, strategy. I don't my finger, blistered. Do you burn yourself off then? No. So we're just about to go and do um, talk sport radio. This man's gone straight to the bar. Stressed? Not stressed, he's just really craving one at 10 a.m. Oh, yeah, he does this every time he has to do media. <laughs> yeah, maybe a bit stressed. Yeah, what a is bit it? Of anxiety. A Dutch, Dutch courage, isn't it? Yeah, I need about five of those for that. Amaretto sour. There he is. Delicious. Delicious. <laughs> there, all your nerves gone straight away. All right, we're about to go do talk about radio in. Where are we? It's like a food hall. But we're going to be here. All done. Ooh. See you later, guys. Bye. See you later. So, just finished with Talk Sport. Just finished with Talk Sport Radio. It was all right, wasn't it? Yeah, they it was are fine. so nice, the boys. Yeah. It's the first time I've ever met them. Yeah, I met Ali in Loch Lomond in Scotland. Such a nice guy. Yeah. He's just so personable and. I feel like it like it all happened really really quickly yeah, so out. we literally came in they were asking us questions we just sat down we didn't even have headpieces or mics on and then they were actually trying to elongate their answers I mean their questions so that we could get our headsets on and then it was like boom 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 me, I've never met them before yeah, Mia was ever the pro no I wasn't. natural in front of the mic or camera you said I changed my voice. Yeah, you speak really calmly about things and really? change your tone. Everyone says I speak way too quickly. They're like, how do you get so many words out Sometimes in such a do. small space of time? Yeah. That's Instagram. It was good though, wasn't it? Yeah, it was good. What I was going to say is they're so, like, I'd never met them before, but they made me feel like they were like my best mates in two seconds, which is like an impressive skill to have. Yeah. You're not even filming me at this point. <laughs> you just tripped. <laughs> You had like half my head. <laughs> um, anyway, that is a job well done. So if any of you heard us on TalkSport, thanks for tuning in. <laughs> so Pete and I have gone to work together today. How exciting, right? Every time he talks, it sounds like he speaks so sarcastic. <laughs> I'm really happy to see you, Mia. Sorry, sorry Mia. I'm just... I'm a little bit, like the coffee's wearing off a little bit, I need some espresso to... How many coffees have you had? Honestly, I've never met a man who drinks more coffee than this guy. Yeah, six so far, but... And it's not even midday, I'm not even kidding you. Well, I'm not allowed to have a cappuccino after midday, so I'm going to have to get him in quick. What? What's the logic behind yeah, that? It's like an Italian thing, you're not allowed to have them after a certain point. So, so then what do you have instead? Espresso. <laughs> or a latte. <laughs> Makes so much sense. Or is it a latte with dinner or after dinner? There's like a whole set of rules and regulations I didn't know about. So, so. affogato though, that's what you had yesterday. Affogato, you can have it any time. Okay. It's got ice cream in it. So I'm... ice cream just cancels out any rules. Because <laughs> it's ice cream. Obviously. Love the logic. So. Yeah. That's what I need to get today, is an ice cream. We are about to film in some of these cars. So many, and do you know what? Those red ones, I swear down, they must be USA cars for the VIP golfers. That's what we're getting, isn't it? No, but we're getting a blue one, do you know what I mean? So, red for the USA, blue for Europe. Now, I am not one to cast doubts on the organization of the pool car area, but I highly doubt they've managed to No, do I think that's totally legit. I'm spreading nah, that rumour. No, nah. I mean, you can you can try if you want, but I'll be there to poo-poo that rumour. <laughs> hey, don't rain on my parade. Oh, what is that? <gasps> wow, no, this is so cool. This is the XM. Have you seen the XM? It's, you've sick. got a mega truck, but this is a mega, mega truck. That's... Isn't it? And have that's... you seen the matte black one with red? That was sick. All right, we are all mic'd up this with our little mic here. Like we're going in the i7, so we're filming in this bad boy today, which has the really cool um, screen that comes down that we showed you the other day because Ollie and I were so excited about it. Here's Mr. Finch also getting mic'd up. And this is the team who are filming today. Whoa. It's just mad that you can watch this from in the back of the car. Look how big the screen is. Wow, that's unreal. 
fans. They're every, look how big the screen is. And my camera can't even see it all. Imagine how he must feel. I'd be so nervous. So impressive with all those people. That's scary. Wow, I cannot imagine what it must feel like. Oh, it's boiling. So hot out there, man. Wow. Sweltering. Dicey. <laughs> if you're walking around there, wow. So, we're currently on the hunt for some, some gelato. gelato. Without luck. It's 30 degrees. <laughs> it's so hot. It is roasting. I feel like I'm sweltering. But I've just had gelato on my mind for days now. I need to go and find it really, otherwise... You know one of those days where you really, really, really crave something and you just never get to have it and then you just feel a little bit disappointed, so... We're on the hunt for gelato. <laughs> Here she is. Well, how did we even walk past this a minute ago? I have no idea. I wonder. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. Terrible, terrible Italian accent from me there. <laughs> what would you like? Frozen yogurt. Cookies and chocolate, please. Please, can I have one frozen yogurt with cookies and chocolate? <laughs> That looks nice. <laughs> That's why I wanted to see what yours looks like. A lot of pressure, right? Eh? Yeah. <laughs> looks good. Mm. Delicious. Can be better. Mm. <laughs> and it comes with No, no pressure. Beautiful. Estoy muy nerviosa. Thank you so much. Enjoy. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. It's not actually gelato, it is a Mr. Whippy. However, so it did come with biscuits and chocolate, so I feel like we're just going to crack on, aren't we? <laughs> and a waffle. I love ice cream. Wow. This is pretty cool. We're going on a little potter. Got everything. Every time I go to a new part of the course, I'm like, looks great from up here. <laughs> How's it been today, Ollie Rob? I'll leave her off. <laughs> sound like my mum. Maybe that's where I've got it from. That's what she calls me. She rings me up. All right, Ali Rob. I think that is probably yeah. where I heard it. Yeah, it's been pretty cool. Good day. Sebsy Brown standing in front of us. Hello, hello. I've just missed Tyrrell's shot. I'm fuming. I just heard everyone cheer. No idea what's going on. got his phone out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, a bit delayed. How are you enjoying your uh, Ryder Cup experience? Oh, this is amazing. Oh, yeah? This is incredible. First time ever. First time in Rome, first time to a Ryder Cup. Uh, this has been special. Yeah. It's amazing. It's Corey. It's, it's yeah. Corey. Yeah. What's up, guys? It's Corey, Corey from Be Perfect. Kobe. Yeah, that all Kobe. Yeah, it's, your the names world's are most too confusing similar. names. Corey, Kobe, twin brother. Cody, <laughs> tall guy, doesn't actually look anything like us, but his name is exactly the same. Um, but yeah, it's been awesome here. Garrett. Do you love your played in the all-star match here and he got a birdie on this hole actually wow, really? yeah, it was on Tuesday. yeah dro drove, wow. it in, drove it into that bunker right there that is up and down from there so he's he's being very critical of anyone that doesn't birdie this hole <laughs> flush down no speed boo no we have got team europe and team USA right no here. we're getting it handed to us right now <laughs> Yeah, I take this whole thing to America ASAP. That's why. Look how that many people wild. there are on the 16th right now. Like, look at all these little people. They're everywhere. Here he is, Mr. Richie. Hi. Let me, let me allow me. Oh, you want to show yourself? Yeah, of course. Hi. Hi, everyone. Hope you're good. It's Rick Shields here at the Ryder Cup, having a great time. Um, Europe absolutely smashing it. Mia Baker here is having the best time in the world. It's the best. I've, I don't think I've ever seen anyone more excited at a Ryder Cup than you. It's not that great. <laughs> it, would be, it would be better if things were going differently. You know, it, if we were winning, of course it would be. Maybe one yeah. day. Well, maybe, 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 one day. <laughs> maybe, maybe in two years. Probably in America. Probably tomorrow. Look at this scene. How amazing is this? Yeah, absolutely incredible. Incredible! Yeah. See, this is the uh, the last great hope of America here, and we're on day one. Jordan and Justin, who a lot of them said shouldn't even be in the team, JT. Well, he's doing all right, but this is incredible, guys. If you haven't been to a Ryder Cup, get yourself down here. This is what it does to you. It makes you smile, look. Realize yeah, what's up, guys? Corey, free dude, perfect. Having the best time here at the Ryder Cup. Uh, you're catching me with America. When you're watching this, you probably have realized that we won. <laughs> but right at this exact moment, we're we're currently slightly down. I think it's about six to two. Um, so it's really cool to um, know that at this moment was the beginning of the comeback. So um, congratulations to me and my whole country in America. Uh, love you guys. In case that I'm wrong, and it turns out in case out, you're wrong, this the other be way, in black and white with somber uh, music. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just like if, if, if this does not age well, then that would be the other way this goes. But I'm sure we won, and congratulations to America. 
from Montafi. They've had a good time at the Ryder Cup today. How many amaretto sours? I think 15 or 16. No way. Yeah. That's so many. I'm feeling pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine. Check this. Look at that view. It's unreal. I keep saying that, but I can't get over it. I can't believe it's the first day. It feels like we've been here a week a week <laughs> like so much has happened in one day isn't it so i just think this is one of the coolest events i've ever been to it's a surreal experience isn't it i think yeah like everyone watching this has to try and get to one rider cup in their life yeah time. i think so it's like it's a bucket amazing, list thing yeah. and then yeah i agree the sun thing. is setting it's the end of day one at the rider cup my very first rider cup Look at it, it's so beautiful and pretty. We are en route to get our BMW home. Food, maybe, tonight? What do you want to do? Yeah, a bit of dinner somewhere. When in Rome. When in Rome. <laughs> There's so many places to choose from, it's actually really hard to know where to go, so recommendations would have been great, but I guess a little bit later. <laughs> if you're viewing this video and you've got recommend recommendations for Rome, let us know. <laughs> <laughs> bit late, but, and as Ollie said earlier, I would highly recommend putting Ryder Cup on a bucket list thing to do. I think actually if you're from America you should do an American Ryder Cup and if you're from Europe you should do a European Ryder Cup I think. We haven't done an American though so. I know but I feel like there'd be a lot of Americans and not enough of us and I'd feel a little bit like yeah. in the minority. Americans are nice though aren't they? Americans nice are, people. they are really nice yeah. and they're always like hey y'all yeah. you're doing great you're amazing. <laughs> you just come away feeling really good about yourself yeah. don't you? Be what? Welcome to day two of the Ryder Cup. And it is so early, we're rushing again. I mean, we're both half asleep at this point, to be honest, but we have to be there for the seventh tea. Seventh tea. <laughs> this tea. I'm chatting rubbish. We need to be there for 7 a.m. so we can film on the first tee, because that's my job. And Ollie, absolute legend, coming with me, waking up at 5 a.m. Just for moral support. I feel great about it, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired as all. This is your dream, really, isn't it? Yeah, I love getting up early. <laughs> Nothing I'd rather do than have like five hours sleep, wake up at 4.30 a.m. Back another day. I have no idea how it is this noisy already. <laughs> what is going on over there? I have no idea. It's so dark. Right to me. Oh yeah. Oh god. You've got to get up for it every morning, haven't you? It's like once in a lifetime thing. Have yeah, you have to it. get up, even if you're tired. And bonus point, we don't have to wake up at this time tomorrow. Don't we? Nope. Starts later. Uh, oh, yeah, because it's singles. Yeah. And bonus point for me, because I got up early for you. <laughs> In the good books all day, guys. <laughs> <laughs> all mic'd up, ready to go. Good turn. Go BMW, best seat in the house. Ollie's taking the camera, he's going to go and watch me as I sit on the first grandstand. <laughs> That's how we do. Let's go. <laughs> Best seats in the house. It's great to be in BMW seats. They're literally straight from the car. Look who's like been roped wow. into a little bit of filming in the <laughs> VIP seats. Oh, look who's joined oh. us! <laughs> Come on. How are we? Just smashed two coffees and sprinted over it. I love that face. <laughs> Pure joy. Let's go. It's in good jazz. <laughs> it's in good jazz. Until they win. Tasty group. Yeah. Brooks and Scotty. Don't know. This is going to be a tight game. Tight game. <laughs> oh, 
Yeah, what are your Ollie songs? Here's, here's to you, Ollie Robinson. What does that get like? So like, here's to you, Ollie Robinson. Why have you got such a slow song? England, so that's one. England love, and then... England love you? More than you will know. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. That's quite cute. And then... Like, Ollie, Ollie, Ollie Robinson, that one. Can't remember how that goes though. And then there's another one that's like a bit quicker. Oh, I think it might be... Oh, oh, oh. Ollie, Ollie, no, Ollie. Ollie. Yeah. Oi, oi, oi. That's fun. Yeah. Check out a few. <laughs> Scotty Scheffler and Bruce Necker. Victor Holland and Ludwig What's your favourite chant? Oh, there's so many. Where do I start? <laughs> <laughs> I do like the right, middle, left, right. left yeah. side one. I just learned that now. Yeah. It's the right side, yeah. the right I like side. I like like the the names. Right. Oh. Serpy, 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 serpy. And then it goes straka, straka, straka. <laughs> and then what would mine be? Like, we say Mia, you say Baker. <laughs> Mia, Baker. No, I think it's rubbish. <laughs> yeah. This is why I'm not a singer songwriter, okay? <laughs> I can't think of anything. <laughs> We've got hot pancakes today. And a little dollop of Nutella. Cake or Taste test. Do you want to do that? Or do you want Yeah. Really, really good. Insane, actually. They are really good pancakes, it. You try it. Taste, Taste test. <laughs> I'm not actually putting anything on mine. Is that weird? No. I like things just plain. Get the pure taste. Like a blueberry muffin without the blueberries. Basically guys, it's just a pancake. <laughs> it tastes like a blueberry muffin. It's so good. Oh my god. And she's off. I'm See ya. To explore. <laughs> I love how everyone's just so nice to everybody. <laughs> Look at these little outfits. Thank you. I actually thought they were avocados earlier, but I've changed my mind. They're actually the greens. greens. <laughs> Close. I do like avocado though, so it would have been a win of a t-shirt anyway. Everywhere we go, there's food spot after food spot after food spot. Got even more here. This is just like a little side section. So there's people everywhere. It's pretty cool. What time is it? It's ten. <laughs> not even. Eleven. It's not even ten yet. It's like ten to ten. I only been out five hours, no biggie. Everything is so blue. So in America, I'm assuming everything is really red. Is Must be, happens? yeah. New York in two years. Mm. Oh yeah, that would be so See you there. That be so <laughs> yeah, you guys definitely have to try and get to a Ryder Cup. Right, so we've just stumbled across BMW Lounge. So apparently, the Ryder Cup has spaces. If you own a BMW, you get to go here. It's actually quite nice. It's a bit cool in here. It's not too hot outside yet, but it's going to get boiling later. So this is kind of like a neat trick. They also had one of these at Wentworth, you know? Yeah. So it's pretty cool. I wonder if you get special parking here if you've got BMW. Maybe. I did not spot this. The man behind the camera spotted this. The guy who's meant to be tracking their calories. I'm not eating any, I just saw it. Yeah. <laughs> You're just eating with your eyes. It's like being um, like at a fun fair, isn't it? If you were to hypothetically eat a sweet, or choose a sweet, what are you picking? Oh, really? Yeah, love those. Really? Or strawberry cables, those. Oh, yeah, I love a strawberry label. Yeah. Look at the fudge as well. Oh, these are good. They're all good, really. Yeah. <laughs> you have a big sweet tooth, really. I don't know what you're talking about. Why you... <laughs> Stop beating me out. Yeah. What are you talking about? I don't like sweet stuff. What looks good? They're good. They're good. Oh, what about these? Remember, like, twisters, but, like, fizzy twisters. Right, let's continue on our walk. Remember, we had one too many pancakes. I mean, I had all the pancakes. I'm not eating yet. And... <laughs> Only egg. Wasting away. You're on holiday, you're allowed. I had a nice oat milk coffee. Yeah. And then I did have a pancake with some bacon and maple syrup. It was... Oh no, it was so good, wasn't it? Yeah. We're just walking up and there's more food spots right down there. 
ever oops I just got that lady tripping up on camera good trip to Rome <laughs> poor women how was the Ryder Cup <laughs> they yeah. sort of everything I mean you said they had the Italian Open yeah. previously in the year yeah obviously learned from that haven't they but it's, it's pretty cool the whole place is just it's almost perfect I'd say for the Ryder Cup isn't it it is even the viewing on there alright how are you going did you hear what you just said what is that your mate <laughs> I'm mates with everyone <laughs> I think it's stressful having fans not from your country. Yeah, it's always going to be difficult. Look at this view, guys. Unbelievable. The course is so pure. Here's Mia trying to get the action shot. We've hit a wall, guys. <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> My eyes are watering. <laughs> Hours and counting, quarter to 11. Oh, hours of awakeness. Two days in a row. Quarter to 11, I've got to film in 15 minutes. Four hours sleep, both nights, maybe five. It's hard though, no matter how hard you try, you always go to bed at like 11 pm or midnight. Time, yeah. Even if we got to be up at 5, 4, whatever. You also, still go to bed at 11 pm. We, we didn't get back to what, 8, 8 39? Yeah. And then we had food. We ate dinner at like 10. Yeah. It's, sort of it's actually quite exhausting. <laughs> but it's fine. We've got to just be ready to go. It's not what she said a minute ago, guys. She was about to fall asleep. <laughs> Where do I get my energy from? Sugar. Sugar, yeah. Maybe you need some food or a drink. Yeah. Oh, yeah, a drink. Peach diced tea. I'm going to Famous Guardians of the Cup here. What has been your famous? You are famous. They're <laughs> everywhere. You will not miss these guys. What's been your favourite yeah. moment so far at the Ryder Cup? Meeting you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at these charms. Already seen the Guardians. See, got my burst of energy now. I'll take a little bit more of this uh, lemon iced tea, squashed. <laughs> Brushing. Lipton. Never tasted better. That's a sponsorship gig as well. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that wouldn't be a bad one, That'd would it? Cool, yeah. We've got fans from all over the world here to support their favourite team. We've got the USA, we've got Europe competing head to head. And we're going to go and have a look at some of the fans' outfits because they have been on point today. A little behind the scenes with Mia Baker. Don't, I don't, the words just came out of nowhere. I didn't even know what I was saying 99% of the time. <laughs> USA outfits I've seen here at the Ryder Cup. Talk to me. What are the hey. horns about? Hey, we're the American Marshals. This oh. is our eighth Ryder Cup in a row. We started as Vikings. That's where we have the horns. And okay. we do have the best outfits. And we, ha we do have the best cheers. And we engage with the team and the fans. That Here we amazing. come, walking right. down the street. We get the funniest looks from everyone we meet. Hey, hey we're the Marshals. Do it right here for her right okay. here. Yep. And, sure. and you need our you need our Oh I need a stickers. Sorry Europe, I've just joined Team USA. Yay! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just for a moment in time. <laughs> you are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when the skies are gray. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. I would say I suck at live stuff. I love performing in front of a camera. I say love performing. I don't know why I You're just You're good said at that. live stuff. I like talking to a camera, like it feels more comfortable, but as soon as it's live, I'm rubbish. No, you're good at it, you just don't enjoy it as much. Yeah, I don't know why. You're still good at it though. I just like, maybe it's like a lack of control, do you reckon? Yeah, I'm... I just don't think I'm very good. You are good at it. I don't know, I just think I'm not very good at it. You are good. It's a tricky situation. Number, number one fan ever. <laughs> That's mine. Just a nice little bit. Just being careful, you know, with the calories and all that. <laughs> Can you do a tiramisu taste test? You said you've never had tiramisu before. This is your tiramisu. I didn't get any. I didn't get any tiramisu. Sorry, can you test my tiramisu for me? How is it yummy? Is it alcoholic? It's really yummy. Is it? Yeah, you'll like that. It's like a an eight. An eight? It's pretty an eight good, dessert. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> you have to bend down so much. Um, so we came back and we had a little secret nap. We were so tired, but we oh, were like dying. I couldn't function anymore. Yeah, so my tired. head was hurting as well a little bit. Um, lack of sleep really does 
not bode well. As much as we would love to take you out with us, I'm going to leave you at home because the camera's kind of heavy, isn't it? Yeah, really heavy. And we'd bring it out all day. It's really, really great. We love having you, but we are going to go to dinner on our own. <laughs> so we'll catch up with you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Good morning. It's the final day of the Ryder Cup today. I'm not working today, which I'm very excited about because I... I've not really been to many events where I don't work at all. So today's going to be fun because I could just chill and I can just enjoy it. And I think we want to go and follow a few people. I think Ollie wants to go and follow Sepp Strucker around a little bit. I'd quite like to follow Victor. Um, I think that would be good. I mean, his golf has been so good, like unbelievable. He's just so talented. That's why I really like. I love watching really good golfers. I also love watch I just love watching people being exceptional at whatever it is they do. We need to go and catch our car, get to the course and then yeah, go and explore again and enjoy the final day. How are you feeling for the last day of the Ryder Cup? Buzzing. <laughs> I'm excited, yeah. I wish we got up earlier to catch the first tee, but excited to see Sepp and a few others play. Come in. <laughs> Morning go. man right here, as you can tell. Yeah, it's at 5 30 a.m. guys. So <laughs> early again. The fans are all in the stands and we could be there right now, but we are not. <laughs> we are walking over. We're actually going to do a little tour of the Sky Sports studio. It'll be quite close to the first tee, won't it? It is on the first tee. Yeah, we could. Oh, don't you just love the fans? <laughs> They're all so happy. So, ends up I was looking at English time for the tee offs. <laughs> And it's not 10.35 first year, it's 11.35, so we're perfect. <laughs> <laughs> we actually are very on time. 20 minutes to spare. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> He's so happy now. I'm happy too, to be fair, but um, that's always a bit of a treat when you get the time an hour wrong. All I got in the room was, we should have got up earlier. We need to get up <laughs> earlier. We should have got to the first tee last day of the Ryder Cup. It's because the alarm yeah. went off and then you went back to sleep. It's been a long weekend, but very good. now look good. at us, <laughs> thriving. We are yeah. about to go in Sky Sports <laughs> Studio to watch the first tee. And the final day of the 2023 Ryder Cup. This is exciting. <laughs> like a little school boy. This is the uh, Sky Sports Studio. Everything that goes on in the back room. All these cables, all these wires. Oh, thank you. Look at this. Wow. What do you think? Yeah, it's cool. Not my first time in a Sky Studio. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Look at them. That is brilliant. Hello. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you doing? <laughs> that is one hell of a photo. Very good view. What do you think? It's not bad, is it? It's not bad. <laughs> not how could it be to hit a shot out there with all these people? <laughs> I know, it's so intimidating. Do you have to go in a minute, Mia? Said you can hit one, said it's fine. <laughs> Harry, view, good. Average. Yeah. <laughs> Rick? This is a really big TV. <laughs> He's on fire this morning, clearly. You can see everything. Wow. That is amazing. I'm just like sweating profusely down there. I mean, it is absolutely madness. Look at you, look at you. You look really fresh. You look, fresh. Fresh. You look Do you want to you see how liar. fresh you look? Liar. Genuinely. Itzy, look how fresh you look. It's so fresh and so clean. <laughs> absolutely madness, isn't it? Slow, slow is back to me. Kind of slow back to me. Yeah, yeah. DP World Lounge. It's actually super cute in here. Do you like the little plants? They're great. <laughs> I think they're really cute. Yes, she is. On the London mules. So my favourite um, beverage, if I had to pick one, would be gin and ginger beer. Look, this is what service you get. You get a fantastic Italian pasta delivered to your table. These Just two, like that. These two desperate for food. <laughs> Some carbs. We'll try some. Thank you so much. This Thank is you. Exactly what I want as well. Yeah. How many yeah. taste tests have we done this week? And they've all been like eight or nine. I think we do everything. It's like eight, nine, or Yummy. ten. Yeah. That's very al dente. If I was Italian, it's probably like a ten, but I'm English. Just nine point seven. Oh wow! Oh, wow. That's wow. I'm, I'm a really generous rating. He's it's very just, hungry. He's <laughs> not breathing. Very generous in my ratings. Look, that is a little bit excessive. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's tomato like pasta, you, really, isn't it? I like the fact you can um, do that too. Yeah, I'm doing that as well. Like I will, I'm just going to go over a nice 7.8. <laughs> yeah. I had to get up to get by. Got aubergine parmigiano, cacio e pepe, risotto. Is that what food channel you've got, mate? Meatballs, 
Rick, food channel or I, what? I'm doing so much food at the moment, like... I'm doing so much. <laughs> I was kind of doing this thing called eating. I kind of do it three times a day normally, yeah? Oh, funny <laughs> guy. Edamame, beans and potatoes and pretty Chicken. much everything I've got too. Have a co Look at Pete in the background. That face is a man who is... Recovering. <laughs> <laughs> He's what? He's doing right there. Recovering. Meanwhile, someone just hit 60%. <laughs> oh! 60, he was starting at 24. Gin and tonic. <laughs> Missed that my whole life. Who'd have drunk it? It's John. You've never drunk them? No, until like a year ago, now it's only, I just love it. Um, what? Well, by the way, I don't yeah, get hangovers. Uh, oh, you only get. Brown, the, like, the cheat code. Seb also just learnt the words my, al dente. My <laughs> hangovers were so embarrassingly debilitating that I couldn't function as an adult parent slash person. And now, on this, I'm having two hours sleep last night. Look at me, I'm ready to go. <laughs> Go, go again. Seb's gone from 26 to... I'm 96 right 96. now. I'm 96. Flying. Look at this as well, it's going up so quickly now. Go on, keep oh, going. 97, well, well, 98. 98. 99. Oh, oh, that's 100. That 83, must be 82. Oh 80, my God, you've you got so many nuts, sir. So many nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Where are they going to do the award ceremony? Where is it? Right there. That's amazing. Just there. It's going to be fireworks. Literally. Have they already preloaded the blue and yellow confetti? I think I'm so. going to say yes. Yeah. I think so. I think the engraver last night was like, let's get it over. Oh, <laughs> get it done. What was that there then, Peter? Seven. Six. Oh. Flash. It says seven on the thing over there, so I'd say seven. Right. seven. Well done, seven. you pass. It's not like I've been here all week. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be so confused. Like, they don't look like that on the telly. Seven. Green. The Ryder Cup's quite good, isn't it? It's the best sporting event I've been to. I think really? Yeah. Very, very good. So unique, so good. Hot take, hot take. F1 yeah. in Abu Dhabi was incredible, but the crowds and the atmosphere you get here are just unparalleled to anything else. Look at that. Who's that? Is that uh, Thomas. Thomas J. Fleetwood. Look how many people there are over there. That is... Crazy. Wow, what part? Sad's in slow mo. <laughs> a bit like that, actually. Yeah, I feel as, like that. As soon as the sun hits you, it's a bit much, isn't it? <laughs> it's really hot, isn't it? Mate, how do you not do sunglasses all the time? I've got really dark eyes. That's not what how it works. What's that got to do with it? That's literally not how it works. I hope we've heard that. Oh, what's it called? The camera where you can change the sunglasses and cameras. ND filter yeah. you can put on. Is that you got? Yeah. Inbuilt ND filters. Inbuilt ND filters. Rick knows everything. Inbuilt ND filters. Oh, ND filters. Oh, merge. Good, good. You're right there, Ollie. I'm just being one of the great like cameramen. <laughs> you know he loves vlogging more than anyone. It's Ollie. Ollie. He's what? like, we should vlog. <laughs> We should vlog this. I'm just okay. trying to, I just like seeing you grow. Should we, should we go that way? <laughs> no, you can't go that way. I think you can. No, 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 no. I think you can. <laughs> See, this is this is what we get. <laughs> <laughs> get that. Get that bit. Get that in. That's part of the montage. The live interactions <laughs> at the stands on a scene. Coming later, Rick and Pete have a disagreement about direction. <laughs> Everywhere we go, it's trillions of people. This is the maddest golf event I've ever been to. It's cool, isn't it? It's very cool. Every how many times have we said that? Like twelve hundred times. Just look at all these people. Every day, every session, more people just arrive. I know, out of nowhere. Even looking back, look how many. It's just unbelievable. Thoughts on Europe winning the Ryder Cup? Yeah, it's been awesome. Right now, it's 11 to 10. Okay, so yeah, yeah. right in there. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking to Ollie, but whatever. <laughs> Look at the scenes. <laughs> I would be so in the water. I would. 100%. Yeah. I mean, Europe have just won the Ryder Cup. That's pretty epic. I'm glad we're up here, Mia. Because yeah. if I was down there, I'd be... Um, Drowned. <laughs> I'd be fishing for golf balls right now. I would, I would. He's about it. Look at all these people jumping in the water. So many people. All right. He's live on IG. <laughs> I can only go with one camera at a time. It's stressing me out. We are live from the first tee at Marco Simone Golf and Country Club in Rome. From the first tee shot to the final putt going in this afternoon. The past three days have once again captured the imagination of not just golf fans, but sport fans around the world. So first up, please put your hands together for the captain of Team USA, Zach Johnson.
hard to put into words. First of all, I want to congratulate the US 12 superstar golfers. It was a pleasure to play against you and compete this week. We have 12 legends, 12 gladiators, and uh, I couldn't have been prouder to be their captain. We came together and uh, we won back the cup. <laughs> I just, I just got out of the way, to be honest. Um, two more years! 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 You have 12 golfers like this willing to, I mean, go on this journey with me and enjoy this, this experience and understand what the Ryder Cup truly means to us. You know, it's, it's a powerful force. Uh, we were able to come together, as I said. I was able to create uh, an environment for them to succeed. But these guys on Friday had to hit the shots. And I'll be forever grateful to them. If you've never been to one, you need to make it a part of your bucket list. It's the best event, the best sporting event ever. Yeah. Like, incredible. The nothing vibes, the energy. Yeah, nothing I could ever imagine. Yeah. <laughs> Ridiculous. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. And we will catch up with you very, very soon. See ya. <laughs> I'd love to start a chat. Like and subscribe. <laughs> So, we just finished the last day of the Ryder Cup and we've got jelly legs. <laughs> You've got jelly legs. You've got, you just said to me, my legs are like jelly. It's been a hard slog out here. You've had your first day off for a while, haven't you? And you've enjoyed yourself. She's had gin and ginger beer, she's had De Serrano <laughs> shots. Evan. Mia Baker's let her hair down. Literally. Shot. That's what the fans want to see. <laughs> this isn't going in the vlog. Look at that little face. <laughs> Hey guys, look, everyone's got to have a day off every now and again. Fun? Everyone's got to have a day off every now and yeah, again. Yeah, well done. <laughs> Did I not just say that the first? Yeah, kind of. <laughs> Little baker. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know the words yet. I don't know Chris Martin. <laughs>